Hey everyone, welcome to my channel and in this video we'll solve this problem from NLM. So let's read the problem. So a rope is placed on a smooth sphere of radius r. The end A of the rope is at the top of the sphere and the end B is at the bottom and the end B is overhanging. The mass per unit length is given. The horizontal string holding this rope in place can tolerate tension e equal to weight of the rope. Find the maximum mass M0 of a block that can be tied to the end B of the rope so that the string does not break. Okay, so do try this problem out for a few minutes and then come back for the solution. So let's begin. The, it was given that the maximum tension the string can handle is the weight of the rope. So the weight of the rope is going to be its mass which is lambda times its length which was given to be pi by 2 plus 1 into r into g. So the tension uh, at this point is going to be t. So now let's take an element on the rope at an angular position of theta and of angular width d theta. So the, let's say the tension here is t and in the direction of increasing theta let's say the tension is t plus dt and so if I shade the element with red the weight of this element will act vertically downwards and its magnitude will be lambda times the length of this part is rd theta, right? So rd theta times g. So this angle is theta. The component of the weight along this tangent is going to be lambda rd theta times g sine theta. Okay, from here we'll get uh, dt equals minus lambda rg times sine theta d theta. So now we have to talk about the limit. So, so at theta equals zero, which means we're talking about the topmost point, the tension on the rope is going to be t, right? So that is going to be lambda rg times one plus pi by two. And at the angular position of 90 degrees, which means we're talking about this particular point, the tension will be the weight of this part of the rope, plus there is also a mass m naught attached at the point b. So the tension at this point will be the weight of this rope plus the weight of this block so that is going to be m naught g plus the length of the rope is given to be pi by pi r by 2 plus r and this length is pi r by 2 so this length is going to be r so this would be lambda rg so the way so the tension at that point is going to be m naught g plus lambda rg so now if we solve the integral the left side would become m naught g minus lambda rg times pi by 2 and the right side would become minus lambda rg integral of sine from 0 to 90 is 1 so this is simply going to be 1 and from here we'll get the value of m0 as lambda rg times pi by 2 minus 1 and this would be the answer to the problem. So guys do like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.